Hello and welcome to Tenses Explained. Today we are going to have a look at the past perfect tense, which we need when we want to talk about an earlier past. As with all the other tenses we have discussed so far, the past perfect tense can be divided into two basic forms, the past perfect simple and the past perfect progressive. Let's have a look at the simple form first. We use the past perfect simple to talk about an event that happened before another past event. Now let's see how the past perfect simple is used. Kate, how was the dinner with your family? I missed the bus. And? When I entered, they had already finished the dessert. Oh no. Yeah, but I still got some dessert, so it wasn't that bad. In this short dialogue, Kate said, they had already finished. And this shows that the event happened before. The past perfect tense can also be used in connection with if clauses to talk about events that did not happen, as we can see in the next dialogue. Hey Paul, how did your test go? Well, it wasn't brilliant. Why? I didn't know about the theoretical part. If I'd practiced that a bit more, I would have passed easily. Don't worry, it's just a test. In this case, Paul uses the past perfect in combination with an if clause to tell Daniel what would have been the case by saying, if I had practiced more, I would have passed. But there is also a second form, the past perfect progressive. It is used to talk about situations that go right up to the past moment we are talking about. Let's see how this works in a real life situation. Hi Anne, what happened? Yesterday I heard Kate, Paul and Terry talking about me when I was outside the classroom. And? When I entered, I could see that they had been planning a surprise birthday party for me. So you ruined your own party? Looks like it, but in the end we decided that we are going to have a party anyways. Would you want to come? I'd love to. In this situation, both events, entering the room and planning the party, are closely connected and therefore the progressive form is used. However, planning the party started a bit earlier. The progressive form can also be used when we want to put emphasis on duration and state how long something takes, as you can see in this dialogue. Where's Daniel? I haven't seen him all day. I met him this morning, but he left school after the first lesson. Why that? When I met him, he had already been working on his English project for six hours. After he attended it in, he went home right away. Six hours? Yeah, but he did it. Here, Oliver uses the past perfect progressive when he wants to state how long something took by saying he had already been working on his project for six hours. As you can see, Depending on the form of the past perfect tense that is used, there can be a substantial change in meaning. 